Hello lovely people, we are talking about acid rain uh, in this particular video and it's a short little video because there's not that much to talk about but here we go. Well we're going to start off here. This is our factory and our factory is burning a whole load of fossil fuels. Fossil fuels, what are they made of? Well they're fossils, they are fossilized organisms from an awfully long time ago, from an awfully long time ago and those organisms contain proteins and those proteins contain nitrogen atoms and sometimes sulfur atoms as well so when you burn those very very ancient proteins that you find in fossil fuels such as oil and coal then you get these sulfur oxides and nitrogen oxides released and generated so we have coming out of these huge plumes of smoke we have a smoke smoke what smoke I don't know smoke Smoke, we have, uh, we have sulfur dioxide and nitrogen oxides and up they rise into the atmosphere. And then those gases are carried by the wind and up here in these clouds they meet water. So sulfur dioxide will then chemically react with the water in the cloud and that will make sulfuric acid. Now you've met sulfuric acid and you know to, hey, be pretty careful when sulfuric acid is around because it's pretty acidic. And nitrogen oxides, well, they can also react with water in the atmosphere and they will form nitric acid, which is, if anything, even stronger than sulfuric acid. So, there we go. So then at that point, now I'm trying to find the cursor. Where's the cursor? Here it is. Here's the cursor. We've found the cursor. Now then, when the rain falls, it falls carrying all these acids. It falls as acid rain. And that has some pretty significant consequences for well, all sorts of things, really. It's written down here. Um, where's the cursor gone? I can't see it. There it is. Acid rain kills plant life. Well, let's have a little look at that. There it is. So, the one on the left, that has uh, had acid rain land on it, and the leaves are killed. You can see they don't look very healthy, do they? The one on the right, well, we're looking pretty smart. We're looking pretty pleased with ourselves. But the one on the left, acid rain kills leaves. Not good if you're a plant because then you can't do your photosynthesis. If you, if you poison a plant for long enough and you kill its leaves for long enough, then you're going to have a dead plant. And maybe that dead plant would little look, look a little like this. Um, dead plants, dead trees, dead pine trees, that's what happens. Acid rain kills a whole load of stuff and kills forests. And if you kill the forest, then you're going to kill anything that relies on that forest for its living, anything that has that as its habitat. Okay, kills plant life, pollutes rivers and streams. You can see this horrible pollution coming into these rivers and streams here. It doesn't look very nice, does it? What's that going to do? Well, we've got dead fish. Of course we get dead fish. We get dead fish every time we do anything to do with polluting the environment. Eutrophication kills the fish. Acid rain kills the fish. It's acidic water. It kills the fish. The fish die. R.I.P. Fish. And then for the sake of completion, well, erode stonework. We're not so concerned about eroding stonework in biology. We consider stonework to be the thing of non-biology. Um, you may think of a better word than non-biology, but I, I work in a world of biology or non-biology. Stonework, non-biology. But for the sake of completion, here is some eroded stonework. And there you can see it. It's probably make it made out of limestone. Limestone is mainly calcium carbonate. And calcium carbonate, as you will recall from your chemistry lessons, will dissolve very nicely if you put it in acid. And so if acid rain lands on it, it'll dissolve it away and you'll get some nice fizzing carbon dioxide given off by it. Goodbye, scary goggle face. So, here is our summary of stages in acid rain. Number one, burning fossil fuels releases sulfur dioxide and nitrous oxides. Number two, this is because proteins in fossilized trees and animals contain sulfur and nitrogen. These react with water and clouds to make sulfuric acid and nitric acid, and this falls as acid rain, damaging leaves, killing plants, acidifying lakes, and how do we always conclude? By killing fish. Pity the fish.